Um, to me, BBS is a, uh, it's a proactive approach towards safety instead of a reactive. It's not always finding something to fix that we can buy. It's changing our behavior on the job. Uh, to me, BBS is just watching out for each other. I know a lot of people have told me that BBS is a telltale, like it's a tattle system. To me, uh, BBS isn't. Uh, I think with BBS in that aspect makes people communicate more with the at-risk behaviors and um, they learn from them instead of saying, oh, I'm not going to tell because I'm facing maybe a chance of getting rode up. I mean, to me, we communicate more since we've started doing BBS and doing them the right way and talking them over. People are more willing to communicate about safety. It seems to get everyone talking about safety a little more. I mean, it's really things we should be doing anyway. We have to make sure that we do listen to everybody. You know, and we have to make sure that uh, we have the right intentions in doing it, and that is to truly keep each other safe. It's really helped a lot of people become more aware of situations and things that they're doing wrong. Um, I, th I think it's all about safety, and it's always been about safety. I, I really like it, and I think it works. Well, nobody loves me more than me, and I've got to be safe to go home at night. And I want these guys to go home at night. I'd say the danger level on the road's pretty high. I mean, you know, anything could happen, especially this day and age with cell phones, people not paying attention on the roadway, you know, wrong place at the wrong time, you could be seriously injured out on the road. I'd say any chance that we could get to, you know, keep each other aware of safety and keep it in mind and keep it a top priority would be the right thing to do. Our job's very dangerous. Getting hit when we're flagging, backing accidents can cause stuff. You have limbs falling, we deal with electric lines, water lines, gas lines. I mean, there's many factors that could put us at risk every day. Yeah. Everybody wants to go home safe. You know, nobody wants to get hurt. As soon as we leave this shop of a morning, there's some kind of risk we're going to have to deal with throughout the day. You know, if more people are aware of that and watching out for each other, uh, you know, it, it helps minimize that kind of stuff. You know, we lost a guy last year. You know, it hurt each and every one of us to lose that guy, you know. Um, we all matter greatly to each other and we all matter to our families. And we all need to get home safe. When I was doing the Leadership Academy, I had probably 30 or 40 people in a room and everybody in that room had a near death experience on a job. So. That's why I think it's important.